Well, what he's new for us this year, and in,、uh, in the music department, we've been trying to experiment a little with how it can、uh, benefit learning in our classes. And just the other day, I had this really great lesson where OLP basically began and ended the lesson, and did really great things for for me and for the kids. So in the beginning of the lesson, I used the the、uh, hosting function and made a poll where I asked、uh, basically diagnostic questions about what we've been studying. We've been studying harmony, so we talked about major chords and how they're constructed and things like that. So in In doing that, I was able to to see with within minutes who understood the concepts within the class, and who、uh, was having was struggling with the concepts of the construction of the chords, and that allowed me to review some principles and, and concepts and clear things up for those who didn't quite get the concept, as well as、uh, reinforce what was already known. So from there, we launched right into to an activity where they were creating chord progressions. With melodies that would be appropriate, and the great thing about this is that students were able to open up their laptop, use the app Photo Booths, record their work, and put that up and post it to the OLP. Then we brought all of that back to the classroom, reviewed it as a group,、uh, fed back、uh, verbally within the class, and then students are able to go home,、uh, give feedback individually on all the different、uh, performances that they saw on on the OLP website itself. So. That just was a great example of how it brought everything full circle within within one class. I think for me, OLP has been a way of saving time. So in doing those diagnostics, where you can really get some quick answers if you need them as to who who needs what in in their learning, and and it's also housing all of these answers in one place. So not only am I benefiting from it, other students are benefiting from other student answers, which is really cool. So. It's developed this sense of of、um, community-based learning, where questions can be answered and refined. Answers can be refined by the addition of other input from different students. So for me, I think that that is the biggest thing for us is being able to have that kind of collective knowledge of the subject that's being studied within one place, and everybody has access to it.